Um, Gatorade is, is huge, um, and the uh, Athlete of the Year is, is, is huge, and it's been around since I was in, in high school from um, Bishop Gorman High School in Las Vegas. But um, just, just to be a part of this event, it is awesome, you know, meet all these great players and um, great younger generation players, and um, it, it's very um, eventful. It's just definitely a blessing and a privilege to be here. Covered a lot of Bishop Gorman this last year. They were national champions. Uh, I bet you were uh, proud of... Uh, the blue and orange. Uh, tell me about your days in high school. What do, what do you remember most about them in high school? And uh, maybe not necessarily a great play. Just what do you remember most about high school? I just think the friendship and the you know family. Um, and that's what Bishop Gorman is all about. It's all about you know great education, all about family, safe environment, and um, it's a close close group of um, you know of families and people in that that's you know in that involved in that that, that high school and. You know, I still talk to the Fertitas, the Sartinis, um, the Wilkinsons, Wadhams. Um, those are like family to me and, and my family, you know, and they've always been in our lives, we'll, we'll always be in their lives in, in a positive manner. So it's, um, I think that's, that's awesome. Yeah, can you talk about that? I mean, you're now in a professional sport. It's a, a job to a large extent. I mean, I mean, do you sometimes, you hold a great affection to that high school days and hold on to it a little bit? Um, passing, you know, obviously they're great. Obviously, I still have a lot of great friends that I, I still keep in contact with, and we still talk to. But you know, high school is fun, and um, but there's no no better feeling than uh, playing in the National Football League. And um, yeah, I'm definitely blessed to you know be a part of this league. And um, I definitely every day I, I don't I don't take it for granted. Did you have you seen Kyler Murray play at all? Uh, the, the, the gentleman who won, and uh, uh, have you? Uh, did you get to talk to him? And if not, what kind of advice would, would you give him going forward? I got a chance to speak with him briefly, um, but obviously he's, he must be a stud with the Murray last name. But, um, <laughs> he, um, you know, I would just tell him have fun. Have fun with this process. Make the best decision for himself. Um, you know, enjoy it. It's going to, you know, go by, go by fast. And um, you got to work hard every day. It's, it's definitely uh, with him being the getting ready player of the year, there's going to be a lot of, you know, eyes on him. And, you know, um, be true to himself, have fun, and, and do whatever makes him happy. Yeah, part of this, I mean, it's fantastic, and being exposed, a uh, big part of high school athletes, high school life now is, all of our life is social media. Can you kind of give some advice to kids about that as well? I mean, it can work for you and against you, I imagine, yes? Yeah, um, just like the famous Herm Edwards, don't press in. Um, but. <laughs> You know, I don't. I'm not much of a social media guy. Um, I do it when I have to, but it's it's the world. It's technology is, is evolving constantly, and um, you know, some people like it, some people don't. And uh, but just have fun with it. If you like it, just be smart with it, and um, you know, always try to use it. You know, for advantage or positive for yourself or others. How about being a? Uh, were you an all-around athlete? Did you play more than football? And if so, a little basketball. A little basketball but. Um, you know, that's that's about it. What do you think kids should be able to, uh, you, the special, do you think they need to specialize earlier and earlier? Or would you encourage them to play at multiple sports? Um, it depends on, you know, how, how their families want to raise them and, you know, what they want to do. But I, I don't think it really matters. You hear all these stories about guys only playing a year or, or two in high school or maybe just coming on as a collegiate athlete than, you know, going to the, the pros and, and doing just great. But, it all depends on you know what you want to do and what you have time for.